talking a lot about um, even on the loving hip hop side you want people to know the real you and you feel like people don't know the real you and what do you want them to know well I feel like as a basketball player you have to have a certain level of discipline you can't do too much the second they catch J.R. Smith in the club is like, oh, JR, he's not focused. No, it ain't that he's not focused. It's just he like to have fun too. Like he still is a professional basketball player that plays at a very high level. So, with being in the NBA, it just comes a lot of you have to, you got to be real. You know what I'm saying? On point. And so, in artistry or being an artist, you able to be creatively free. You able to just be yourself, like night in and night out, express yourself, however you want to express it. And so that's what I feel like now without playing in the NBA. I'm able to do it and I feel like I'm going to get fined for, um, for saying something that I feel or how I think or just being creative in a moment. So that's what I mean. Just people hearing my voice. I don't mean I'm going to be out here wilding and doing dumb shit. It just means that you get to hear me speak and know that I was born for more than just being a basketball player. I was born to be. Basketball was the first step and it's going to lead me to where I'm going right now. So do you think it's completely over? No. Nope. For basketball? No. Nope. Still chance? Yeah, so is Gotham the, the team you have? Is that the same AAU team? Let me talk to you. Oh, this, is, okay. this is Gotham Ballers is an, is a is a um <laughs> is a league that I'm invested in um with with other NBA players and it's it's because with the NBA when you're done you're done and there's a lot of guys that, that still have talent. There's a lot of guys that the fans still love to see. And so with the Champions League, it's a league that, so you got the D League that you start off with, you got the NBA, and then there's a, I feel like the Champions League will be a league that you still able to see these players come to your city, play, perform, sign autographs, and you still able to connect with them. And so that's the league that we trying to um, get going. Like the big three is kind of, it's, it's similar. That's but, the ice cube one? Yeah, okay. but it's just, you know, it's the half court ball. So oh, okay. Champions League will be five on five. We get out there and play. And it's a lot of, some of the same guys. And it's kind of the same thing. You know, those guys go out and get crazy fanfare because we play in these smaller markets that don't have NBA teams. Right. And so, yeah, basketball don't stop for me. I, it, it's, it's a part of who I am, but I don't want it. It's not all that I am. And that's, what I'm, what I'm preaching and that's what I'm pushing. But yeah, you'll still see me playing ball. You'll see me doing whatever I want to do at this point in my life. Like, that's that's where I'm at. I'm glad at. you're it's like feeling it that way right now. I'm it glad took, you're back to your, your old took, self or, it, or better self. Exactly. It took, it took the grind. It took the disappointment. It took the hurt. It took the pain. It took all that for me to see my sister be so... I cared so much about what people thought about me writing music that I forgot how good I was at it. You know what I'm saying? And so now it's just like, I'm just living. I'm living, I'm trusting God, I'm trusting everything that he's blessed me with. And, and I'm just letting that light shine. Okay, tell them where to find you at. Booby Gang is my Instagram, boobiesworld.com. I want to make it nice and beautiful for y'all. So it's, a, it's under construction, but it's coming real soon. Um, Boobies World One is my Twitter handle. And that's pretty much all oh, of my SoundCloud. It's boobies, it's, it's, it's boobies, soundcloud.com, boobies world, dash, no, boobies dash world. I hope y'all got that. Soundcloud.com, boobies dash world. I got about two records up, but a lot, 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 lot of shit on the way. All right, tell them when to look out for the album, the end of Love and Hip Hop. The end of Love Hip Hop season, but a little spoiler for y'all, episode four, or five, somewhere in there. I write a record about exactly what we talked about, everything that I've been through, all of the pain, exactly what was going on in my head when, when I stopped playing, so people can stop saying that I stopped playing basketball. That's the stupidest shit I've heard. I did not stop playing basketball. Life happened, so I had to just take it as it came. And so I wrote a song about it. It's called Nobody Knows, because obviously nobody knows what the fuck I'm doing right now. Thank you yeah, guys yeah. for tuning in. Anything you want to tell people before we go? Nothing. Just if you want to win, put Booby in. You know what I'm saying? Win Booby's world. 
And yeah, if you blessed with gifts and talents and whatever, go get it. Go get it. Fuck it. That's that's my message to everybody.